Okay, we're on to example two now, and this is a quite a real life car finance question. And it says that a Toyota Corolla is on sale for eighteen thousand six hundred dollars. The car can be purchased on finance, which involves a four thousand dollar deposit and monthly repayments of four hundred and ninety dollars for five years. All right, so be, sometimes when you don't have enough money to pay for the car outright, you've got to pay it off in some sort of monthly instalments. Okay, now if we look at question A, it says what is the total cost of the car when purchased on finance? Now when we say purchased on finance, that means paying it off monthly. Alright, so we'll start um, sort of at the end of the question where it's you'll notice it says monthly repayments $490, 5 years. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to start with that. If I pay $490 every month, I'm going to times it by 12 um, because there's 12 months in a year and I'm also doing it for another five I'm doing it for five years so I'm also going to times it by five and I'll see what I get there 490 times 12 times 5 and that comes out to $29,400 so after five years has finished that's how much money I've paid out okay now we've also got to remember you're not just paying the monthly repayments but you had to pay a four thousand dollar deposit as well so we need to add that on top what do we get that comes out to thirty three thousand four hundred dollars so what's actually happened here is we've actually paid thirty three thousand four hundred dollars for the car as opposed to what it was for sale for which was 18,600 so when you pay on finance you usually end up paying quite a bit more for for the car all right now moving on to question B it says how much interest was purchased on how much interest was paid sorry when purchased on finance now the word interest really means the extra money paid basically what it means so if I had the cash up front I would have paid 18,600 but I paid quite a bit extra so if I subtract them 33,400 and I minus the cash price that will tell me the interest that I paid 14,800 dollars all right that's the the end of example two